Welcome back to Magic the Gathering. So, we're going to do another draft. Oh, it ends in 40 hours. So maybe I should do massive recordings of this just so I can get it, uh, more cards, because this is my only way to get Ravnica Allegiance efficiently. Okay, so let's go straight in then. Here we got... So, well, sign up ends in 40, so, and then you have 3 hours after that. So let's determine, let's see... Uh, enters the battlefield, other creatures control get plus pl plus two, so two two, and gain vigilance and trample on end of turn, until end of turn, okay, that's the seven seven ball for eight, oh god, okay, I think that's the rare that comes in this one, um, what's this one, when a creature you control attacks alone, it gets XX until end of turn, where X is the number of creatures you control, oh, oh, if we can get a lot of low cost things, uh, return up to two target permanents. I kind of don't want to do an adapt deck, but we'll see. I kind of... Okay, so... Oh. Ooh. Green, blue? Tap to add two mana for three? Oh, that is good. Uh, summary German is thing. If it's cast anything, the fight deck thing. Stry. Scry. Enchant creature. Discard four cards and discard two. Death touch. Cat. Forced attack. Defender, tap to creature to thing. Riot. I like Riot. Wrecking Beast. Do we grab Wrecking Beast? And see if we can go down Riot? Because it's a good standalone character. It's green. Hmm. Or do we go red? I don't know. Oh. Because I don't know what the thing... If we grab... I don't want to grab that. That's the rare. Oh. You know what? We're going to grab the, the Engineer. Just because of the mana ramp. Mm, do we? Oh, I don't know. You know what? No. Uh, I like the idea of this one. So we're going to grab it. And we're going to see what options we have. You can't cast non creatures When you tap a land for mana, add one mana of any type of that land produced. Hmm. This one, target creature can't be, can't block this turn, target land you control becomes a 4-4 elemental creature with haste until end of turn, it is still a land. That only costs 3 and that's a true thing with this thing, ooh, actually, okay, that's interesting. Uh, can't be blocked by creatures with power 2 or less, uh, creature controls you cannot be countered, non-creature, a uh, non-token creatures, ooh. Do we grab that? I'm going to grab that. If, if this comes back around, we're taking it, and we're going to be a pure creature deck. And that will just help out with our mana stuff. Okay. Um, I like that. But let's look at the other ones. And uh, you gain two life and draw whenever you cast an instant spell during your main phase. You may return to its owner's hand. High alert. Uh, okay. What's this one? Spectacle. Mm, we're going to go that. That requires a splash in blue. Means we can do some blue stuff, but no, it's what are the options here? Just pure red gains two two or well, the gruel. Ooh, we have a pattern going. I'm gonna grab gruel. Hopefully that doesn't screw me. Um, okay, I like that. Um, let's see. Do we do we do a three colored deck? I'm gonna grab that territorial ball. Oh 
grab that. Haste can't be blocked this turn except for creatures with Defender. I'll grab this guy. It hasn't come back around. Oh, that's that's disappointing. Uh, we'll grab another Tutorial Ball. Uh, we'll grab that. We're grabbing this. Oh no, it's pick 11. There's... okay. Um, you know what? If we're gonna get the blue splash, growth could work. We're gonna grab that. We'll just grab that. That one, I guess. And... Actually, we'll throw that down into the sideboard. We'll actually throw the blue stuff into the sideboard and keep the main red green up top. Alright, that's our rare. Alright. I like the idea of that. I'll grab that. Okay. Dovin is in the hole for this. There isn't really much choices here for us. Actually, there's that. Sorry, uh, Gatekeeper Run gets one for each gate you control, so we want to grab gates as well. Alright. We want the gates to be useful. Uh, I like that idea of that one or this one. That has reach, which is good. Currently we have one gate, so that means our Gatekeeper Ram is a 3-3. And if we get one more gate... Okay, so we'll grab that. another mammoth spider what's our uh, what's our curve looking like uh, okay um do we grab a Rakdos? you know what we'll pray that that comes back and we'll grab the mammoth there's another Rakdos here, but there's that. Uh, that's interesting. That's a low cost thing. We'll grab this. Could be helpful. This one got its uh, mana was taken, okay. What's this? Uh, that's not in our colors. It's in our splash colors, actually, but because we, we have a double in blue, so we can choose some blues if we so choose. Um, and as before, you gain two life. That's actually quite useful. So we'll grab it. It had audio. We'll grab that, I guess. Or do we... Yeah, we'll just grab that. Ooh. Grab the beast. What's this? And as to look at the top four of the thing, you may reveal a creature wild land from among them, put it into the top of your load, put it on top of the library, put the rest on the bottom of the random order. Okay. That could be good ramp, so we'll grab it. Now we're on to pick. Let's see. Screaming equip. Uh, gets three life and has pay two to tap target creature. Okay, what's this? It costs white. Act of treason is interesting. We could throw that into the sideboard if we don't get the actual right cards for us that we want. Or uh, don't really want to splash into white. We could potentially utilize these. But we'll grab another feral. Uh, none of these are interesting, so we'll just grab the blue because we have that splash. Why not? 
Uh, we'll grab that. And we'll grab another cat. And that goes to the sideboard. Alright. That's our rare. Got another mammoth. Got a creeper thing over there. Uh, whenever you're a creature in control with power one or less, it deals one damage to player opponents where that creature is attacking. Okay. Um, we got this red tokens equal to number of things. We really haven't got any of them. So I guess I'll grab that. I guess. Um, I say grab this. Yeah. What's that? At the beginning of your own step, untap all lands you control. Oh. Ooh. E. Interesting. Is there anything else here that we want? I'm going to grab that. That could be interesting. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. We'll grab that because it could be. Uh, we got another rhyme. We'll grab that. That's that's an insta grab. Uh, we're grabbing that. Um, you know what? We're gonna grab this skill gate. I think we're gruel. Uh, is there anything here I want? I think I'll just grab the gruel locket. Because it can do our color fixing. Um, there's another thing. We could grab him, but it's for ones with power of one or less. We really don't have that many of those. Or do we just grab this gate just to have a gate to increase? No, we don't want to do that. That's actually a waste. Because we only have one of them, we didn't get any more. So, I'm going to grab the splash and throw it in. I, I save from the game because it's search for basic land or gate. I think that's a decent one. Or, remote snare. No, we'll go open gates. We're going to lose, we're going to lose. No point getting that. No point getting these two. We'll throw that into the side. Uh, that's in our colors and that's in our colors. I think we're going to go active treason. That's in our colors. We'll just throw that over there. Uh, that's in our splash. So we'll just take that. And we got a Rakdos locket. Which means we can actually play it and sacrifice it if we need at one point. Okay, so let's sort things out. We keep the gate now. We currently have 49, so we need to cut 9 cards. I say we cut 2 of those. Gate drops aren't that important, so we'll just drop that out. One drop. You know, that card's not really that useful for us, so we'll keep these in. 
This could be handy, especially with just a 2-1 coming out on turn 2. I want to keep these. So we have to cut 5 more cards. Let's take a look. Is the Ram Broker really worth it? Hold on, let's do the, the do the math. We have 40 cards in it. So we have 2, 8, 20, 28. No, that's not the, the, the right ratio we want. I, I think it's... 26, 14. 26, 14. And we can splash with, with that in, we can actually splash into blue. So let's take a look at our blue cards. So that is useful because we're going to keep that gate in. So let's go down here. We can keep him in. We can remove you. We're not gonna... We'll keep you, because Roach is good. Act of Treason, Gruel. We want those two. What about you? Savage Smash, target creature, and it fights. That's situational, and we... Uh, let's see, we can remove one of them. Now, mana-wise, we can remove three mana. So, this is as it's recommended. Now, at the moment, we have uh, five, then 22, 26. We have 26 cards here. That's the ratio that we want. So, we need to cull three mana. Do we take away. What's our fire mountains like? We have more green, so we want to keep the ratio up. If I remove two, we do that. Six, six with these, because that adds in, that that adds in a blue, which doesn't really matter for us. We're green, but that can just throw them off. We have it in there just to buff this up to a four, four, and it has vigilance and trample. And in reality, we could throw these two out and add in things, or, we can throw him out and add in something else in our blue, like a flyer, like this guy here. If we get it, but it's not really a thing, I think, I think that's the deck. Alright. So, in the next episode, we'll be trying out the deck. So, I hope you guys have enjoyed the deck building. Let me know what you think. I'm not that great at it, and I'm not sure if I'm drafting correctly. I still... I haven't got the hang of it, haven't learnt that much about it, but we'll give things a try. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time.